shoot that head up. Watch pushing down. Those left jabs to the body early was doing Hilton, working Hilton, good for me, but now he's stopped. Yeah, I know. Stop! Stop! I'm not going to tell you again. When I say stop punching, stop punching, okay? Keep that head up. Okay, well, it's going southpaw again. You know, Castillo is trying to make a brawl out of it, which is what he is supposed to do. Mayweather shooting a right uppercut as Castillo stepped by. That's when you, you've got a butt already. You don't want to turn southpaw too much. Cut by a butt. Tulix telling Castillo not to hold. He's already warned him about punching after the break. Good uppercut. And in terms of style, a good round for Jose Luis Castillo. As more and more, he lures Mayweather into something messier and more ragged than a boxing match. <laughs> you like boxing after dark? May 18, a classic boxing after dark matchup. Okay, we got to close the exits for him and throw the body punches in the bottom and the top. Okay, we're going to give some praise. We won that round. We won that round. <clears throat> okay, let's get lively here. Here is Castillo trying to make this as ugly as he possibly can to throw the dancer off. Out of his rhythm. And I think he's doing a pretty good job of that so far, Larry. Your thoughts? He has. We'll see if he makes it pay off by uh, inflicting enough damage in the next few rounds so that he can do more damage in the later rounds of the fight. He's not scoring enough himself. And that's the point when you get rough and get all entangled like that, you don't land, you don't get any points in. You gotta make certain that you've gotten points in, then you start. Them. I can't imagine he thinks he's gonna win a decision from Floyd Mayweather. I think he's looking for something else. Mayweather's getting sharper and sharper and closer with that right hand. You only hope with a master boxer is that he gets tired. Here's a ripping left out of that southpaw stance by Floyd. Now he turns back around to the conventional stance. Castillo reaching with a looping left hook. You can't get them tired. You got a rough night ahead of them. The way to do that is keep a body punch on them at all times. Jab into the body, slap into the body. Almost impossible for Castillo to land two or three punches in a row. Mayweather so quick and elusive. Doesn't mean that Castillo shouldn't try to throw two or three or four punches in you a row. You just got to do it because if you can throw one shot, you can throw two if you're just not leaning, lunging forward. Get him against the ropes and go for it. Mayweather popping Castillo with a little uppercut to make space and get away. Castillo more and more just wading in, getting close at any cost, so that he can try to bully Floyd. Vernon Forrest said after his great victory over Shane Mosley that the way to beat speed is with a jab, and Castillo does not have a jab that is very effective. what Forrest did to Mosley when Vernon talks. We listen. That was quite a show. Our right body hand to the body Castillo. by Castillo. You see, the body, he moves all he wants, but he, the body is going to stay right in front of him. Just throw for the body. That's what Castillo should be doing. Throw to the body. Like all of Mayweather's opponents, Castillo said, I'm going to pressure him. You have 
succeeded to the degree to which Castillo has succeeded so far. Doesn't necessarily mean he's winning the fight. Mayweather smiling at me, something went wrong. And Mayweather giving that to Castillo via the glove to try to let him know that he thinks it's he fun to, to have a fight hand. like Fuck this. That. Stay right hand. You beat him easy, right hand. All right. You ain't got your left hand on. You beat him easy. You beat him easy. Right. You beat him easy, right hand. Okay. Smart boxing. That's Don't what you want. Listen. He ain't with a rise on but he ever land. Listen. Keep the jab working. Keep fighting smart. Keep busting him up. Okay. You, you're trying to focus too much. Hit him on the chin. Hit him on the body. Okay. Okay. All right. Tenemos que hacer la salida si no dejarlo pensar. We got to close it. Vamos a meter con cintura, pero lo vamos a tirar golpes. Vamos, vamos, vamos. Take him down. You see it getting a little rough in there, but then you heard you heard his uncle Roger tell him stop switching to southpaw. You're beating him with conventional style. First copy box number to really stick out so far. Power shots in round five. Castillo 15 out of 30. Mayweather seven out of 13. And you see that Harold Letterman gave the last round to Castillo. Fight getting closer now as we reach the sixth out of 12. Here comes that USA chant again. Floyd must feel like he's back at the Olympics. That has a lot of effect on the crowd, on the, the opponents too, because Castillo was expecting a lot, a big turnout for himself. But that's a good crowd out there cheering for Mayweather. His corner told him to keep the left jab going, burst, burst him up. Keep, keep the left jab on him. He's doing a good job of it now. Incidentally, going back to our pre-fight feature, there's a hard straight right hand by Castillo against the ropes. There's those punches that hurt Mayweather hand. Start throwing him on top. Good left hook to the head by Mayweather. Right, right. I was just about to say the good news, George, is that we're into the sixth round and there's absolutely no sign of any hand difficulty for Mayweather so far. Right. Stop punching. He's, this is the round he started to throw more to the top of the head, which you got to be careful of. It's the top of the head and the elbows where the danger lies. That's true. And when it hurt, he said the first time it happened to him, he never experienced that kind of pain. Now if it happens again, he has an advantage. He knows what it's all about. It'll pass. Castillo banging to the body. Mayweather goes down. Jakulic rules no knockdown. Watch out, Russell. Mayweather is complaining of low blows. Well, he's got a lot to complain about as Castillo continues to turn this into a barroom brawl. And that's what you got to do if you want to beat Mayweather. Keep this thing at a brawl. You're not going to win a boxing match with Mayweather. You gotta push, you gotta shell. Good counter left hand by Mayweather as Castillo stalked him into the corner. Castillo lands a straight left and backs Mayweather into the ropes. Lloyd punching back, another good round as the fight continues to grow in intensity. Hey, stay away from the rope. Keep him in the ring. Time, if you don't do anything, time up. Give him grease. Wipe the grease off his face. Put the grease on his face. Yeah, you, you won this round real big. Now you, you got confidence. Okay, now we gotta grab him and finish him off. Now you got him? Yeah. He, he, don't, don't, don't be over anxious. You're going to get him now. He's yours. 
Here's the low blow that the left hand, you'll see that Mayweather complained about. The referee did not see the punch. Overall, Castillo landed 24 punches in the round, doubling Mayweather's CompuBox estimate. And among them, 19 out of 29 power shots. Big round for Jose Luis Castillo. Harold, how do you have the fight scored halfway <laughs> okay, through? Okay, Jim, I think the champion, Jose Luis Castillo, certainly caught up in rounds five and six. Without question, the first four rounds were dominated by Mayweather. I gave Castillo the third, but in rounds five and six, Jose Luis Castillo seemed to take over simply because Floyd Mayweather laid on the ropes and let Castillo, who's up two divisions, basically... To